In this video, we're going to quickly go through 30 super fast tips to increase the quality of your voice recordings. These easy to implement tips should have something to offer everyone who records their voice, whether they be voiceover artists, live streamers, or content creators. Some of these tips do show examples from OBS Studio, however nearly everything should apply to anyone who records their voice, no matter what software they use. So let's get straight into it. Tip number one, consider investing in a real microphone. The little built-in mics on laptops, tablets, and phones are really not great when it comes to quality. Just about any standalone USB microphone will provide far superior recording straight out of the box. Tip number two, pay attention to microphone placement. When possible, don't have your keyboard and mouse between you and your microphone. Move your microphone in front of your keyboard and mouse to cut down on the noise from key presses and mouse clicks. Tip number three, if you have a microphone stand, consider placing padding such as foam or a towel underneath it. This will cut down on vibrations that may come up through the desktop. Tip number four, even better, consider investing in a cheap microphone arm. This will reduce even further possible vibrations from the desktop as well as allow you to place the microphone closer to your mouth. Tip number five, install a pop filter onto your microphone. A pop filter will help cut down on wind noise as well as reduce the popping sound often made by pronouncing P's and B's. Using just an old sock or a piece of thin cloth can also work well in a pinch. Tip number six, be sure you're speaking into the correct side of your microphone. Mics often pick up sound far better from certain angles. Make sure that that angle is facing you. Tip number seven, having the microphone six inches from your mouth is often considered the optimal distance. A rough way to measure that is to extend out both your thumb and pinky on one hand. That distance is about six to eight inches for an average size adult. Tip number eight, speak slightly over the mic rather than directly into it. This can often not only reduce those plosive popping sounds, but help to reduce unwanted additional mouth sounds in general. Tip number nine, consider the time of day when you are recording. Early in the morning and later at night tend to be quieter times as far as background noise in general. Your environment may vary. Tip number 10. Your voice sounds better when you're relaxed. This may be from recently waking up, after meditation, or even after a warm shower. Your voice tends to be deeper and more full from having relaxed muscles and a calm mental state. Tip number 11, brush your teeth. Not only will it make your dentist happy, but it will brush away all the nasty food particles covering your teeth, gums, and tongue. This will help give your voice a crisper tone and reduce unwanted wet and slimy mouth noises. Tip number 12, stand up while you record. Not only will this get the blood flowing, but it will help prevent your voice from becoming monotone. Tip number 13, try speaking with your hands. Similar to standing up while speaking, moving your hands around and gesturing while you record will help animate your voice and give it a more natural conversational tone. Tip number 14, breathe between sentences. Many people will tend to hold their breath as they speak through a paragraph and begin to strain towards the end as they run out of air. This strain becomes noticeable in the quality of their voice. Tip number 15, try eating something sour. Many voiceover artists swear by eating lemon, sour apple, or sour candy right before or during recording to help speak more clearly. Tip number 16, wear loose fitting clothing. Loose fitting, comfortable clothing will help keep your muscles relaxed, lower your blood pressure, and give your voice a deeper yet greater range. Tip number 17, practice before recording. Not only to warm up your voice, but if you're reading from a script, to become more comfortable with the source material. Tip number 18, practice reading ahead in a script with your eyes as you're speaking. This allows you to have the next phrase you're gonna be speaking saved up in your mind before speaking it. Tip number 19, record a small portion of audio as a test. Then listen back to your recording with the best pair of headphones you have. This will give you a good feel for your voice levels, background noise, and overall quality you're recording at. Tip number 20, don't split sentences when repeating portions of a script. If you make a mistake, go back and re-record the entire sentence. This will make the final recording sound much more natural. Tip number 21, turn off air conditioning and heating units in the room. These air control units can introduce a steady background buzz or wind noise that will be picked up by your microphone. Tip number 22, check for sound coming from your lights. Different types of lighting, such as fluorescent, can emit a low buzzing or humming noise that you are so accustomed to, you may not even notice. Tip number 23, consider recording in a smaller sized room. A smaller room can significantly help reduce the echoes from your voice. A walk-in closet can be an excellent place to record. Tip number 24, 
record in a room with a carpeted floor. In rooms with hardwood or tiled floors, consider laying down a carpet or even a large blanket. Tip number 25, use foam panels around your recording space. These simple foam blocks can make a noticeable difference in reducing unwanted noise. Tip number 26, consider installing a microphone limiter add-on with your software. A limiter will apply a hard volume limit to your microphone signal and not allow the volume to get too high and become distorted. Tip number 27, try installing a noise suppression add-on with your software. This add-on attempts to detect and reduce background noise without affecting your voice. If you have the option, use the highest quality codec the system allows. Tip number 28. Tweak your mic volume so that your voice level tends to peak in the high yellow on your audio meter. Do this by either using a volume control knob on your mic or do it directly in your recording software. Tip number 29. Consider increasing the audio bitrate that you record or stream with. This will increase the size of the files created and increase the bandwidth used by the audio while streaming, but may improve the quality in some cases. Tip number 30, blankets. Lay blankets across the back of your chair, on the floor, hung up on the walls, anywhere you can to help reduce echoes and other unwanted noise. So there you have it. That was 30 super fast tips to help improve the quality of your voice recording. Now, do you have any of your own tips you would like to add? Feel free to leave a comment and thanks for watching.